Hi, uh, my name is Eamon Holland. I'm head of the Glass Brain Workshop here at the Chemistry Department at the, uh, Southampton University. And uh, we do a lot of scientific glassware, all of which is not commercially available for the Chemistry Department and for many other departments around the University. And um, I'll take them on tour of the workshop. This is um, a large coiled condenser. As you can see, you've got a, a coil inside another coil. It's obviously quite tricky to do, and all the attachments at the bottom. This is our um, large lathe, which obviously we use for all the large scale jobs that we do. Um, large diameter tubing up to about 150. And this is some sort of uh, double condenser, which I don't actually know what it does or what it's for, but if you can draw it and bring it to us, then we can make it. This is our grinding room where we've got grinders, a uh, saw, drill, more grinders, all allows us to work with glass, uh, coal. And also we can do uh, obviously the more artistic and fun side of things as well. Hi, my name is Shannon from the University of Southampton. I'm a scientific glass blower here. Uh, we're making lots of sophisticated glassware for uh, sciences in the, the university. Well, we are doing mostly the electrochemical cells and electrodes, sealing glass to metal, all kind of metal. So the Southampton University Glass Blowing Service offers us a fantastic uh, service. Any piece of glassware that we might require for our research, uh, we can always go down and give them a sketch of a diagram and they'll come back with something that often looks more like we wanted than we actually imagined. Okay, so whenever you have accidents in the lab, like this one, you can always go to the people who can help us, which is a glass blowing workshop. They always repair everything. Maybe this one will be a little bit difficult, but any other thing we just can get destroyed in the lab. You can just go there and ask for help and you will have your glass back. Well, I have to say, here at Southampton in electric chemistry, we would not survive without the glass blowers. Um, they make our cells, they make our reference electrodes, and they are experts at sealing metal in glass, which is something you're just not going to find at non-expert glass blowers. Uh, the, the heritage we have here at Southampton is unique. This is a, a cell for electrochemical experiments that was made a few years ago by the glass blowing section. Uh, this cell is designed to have uh, a sample introduced uh, through this port here at the bottom. And then the sample is brought up through the cell so that it can be viewed uh, through this uh, optical window. Um, the cell has double walls so that we can control the temperature um, inside the solution and we've got external ports to be able to bubble gas in the solution or over the solution so as to create a blanket to cool the oxygen from, uh, from coming in. We've got additional, um, additional um, holders to put uh, electrons here and then of course we have ports to um, circulate temperature control water um, around the cell and there is an additional port here for putting a reference electrode. So, um, in my opinion, this is a, a work of art as far as glass blowing is concerned because uh, being able to construct these uh, many, many ports through a double jacket is, uh, is really um, a, a, an extremely high quality piece of work. And uh, I don't know many glass blowing uh, facilities that could uh, actually make this uh, sort of uh, design. This was done obviously uh, through trial and error and, and there was a discussion with the Glasgow section but at the end we wanted um, we, we wanted something really really specific and we got what we wanted. Okay my name is John Dyke I'm head of the workshops in Southampton uh, and I'm keen that uh, people both within the university and outside the university in, in the UK and, and further afield know about the expertise that we have within our workshops. Uh, if you would like to send us uh, work we'll be happy to commission it and cost uh, uh, the work for you and we'll promise a very rapid turnaround.